Anyway, uh, well, I did enjoy the Mets game yesterday. Mm. But I, I, I have to ask the audience. I have to ask Anthony and uh, whoever else wants to listen. Mm-hmm. I, I have a funnier gay. I had uh, gang bang from the entire Mets team. <laughs> no, because that would be well. I decided gay. to pick up marshmallows in front of the entire <laughs> Mets team. That would I be thought it'd be gay. funny. They yelled "gay." No, uh, you're a man taking on the entire team. It's gay. I had great box seats uh, right off uh, first base, and then Mark Turnoff comes down and see how the seats are and stuff, and and we're chatting, we're chit chatting, nice. little chit chat. And then he's like, "What? You want to go up to one of the suites? You know, they have they have a suite." At, at Shea Stadium as well that they give to clients. I'm like, yeah, let's check out the game from uh, up above now because we sat in the box seats for about six innings. I'm like, yeah, let's go check it out. You know, and they have food and beer up there, right? So I get out of my seats. I'm way down, close to close to the field. So I have to walk up, and then I have to walk to my right to the exit. Mm-hmm. It's a long walk in front of a ton of uh, Met fans, a yep. ton of Met fans. And quite frankly, a lot of ONA fans yelling yeah. Opie and you know blah blah blah. Where's Anthony? All that, right? So I'm with Lindsay and I'm with Danny. Danny goes to the game. So I turn as as I, I I'm starting my walk. I turn and I grab Lindsay's hand, right? Yeah. And we start walking, and now it's getting you know very tight. So she's behind me, but I have her hand. So then I reach back lovingly. And I grab her other hand. You know how you do that, you right? You do the two-hand grab from behind you. The yeah. two-hand grab from behind. And now I'm walking with with what I think is Lindsay's hands. Yeah. And I'm walking through the crowd, right? And then she lets go. So now I'm only holding one of her hands. Right. And I'm really into it. You know, I had a really good day, and I'm, like, just holding her hand and, and walking us out of the place so we could go up into the suite. Yep. Just as I get to the, what what is it called, the uh, the, the exit or whatever? Mm-hmm. And now no one sees you anymore. I turn because now I could like uh, you know kind of pull her you know to my side. Yep. And that's when I find out it was Danny. <laughs> you were, you had been holding Danny's hand <laughs> through the crowd. Oh, walk through the crowd. <laughs> oh my God! How embarrassing. They set me up so bad. They set me up so. Effing Bravo, bad. Danny. Why, thank you. So what happened wow, was... Wow, that is embarrassing so, as all hell. So what happened was when I turned and grabbed Lindsay's hand, I had Lindsay's hand. And yeah. now I'm turning around and I'm walking us out and she's behind me. You go for the double hold. When I go for the double hold, it's not Lindsay's second hand. Danny grabs on at that point. So for a little while, I was holding Lindsay's hand and Danny's hand. Lindsay, who has a great sense of humor, realizes what's going on here and let's go. Let go, man. And now I'm, I'm, and I'm really feeling the moment like, oh, this is such a cool thing. <laughs> was he taking his thumb and kind of rubbing your hand, Danny? I don't think I was. <laughs> so <laughs> if I was doing it, I was doing it uh, subconsciously. So now I'm holding Danny's hand through the entire, not the entire crowd, but the entire section. Do you know what people must have thought that I'm know praying you? I'm no one took a picture. And they're, and they're looking going, why is he holding that man's hand and walking him upstairs? <laughs> oh my god, that is so funny and gay.